You know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, okay. Let, let me get this here. Right. Um, okay, so this is the first episode. Yeah. What are we going to talk about? Okay, so. My name. This is Juliet. And this is Uncle T. You have to say right here, baby, for the camera. And can you see him? Yeah, they can see us. So this is Juliet. And who am I? Uncle T. And this is Bibby's World. So today we're getting ready for the sports club's kids to come in. And what are we going to do when they come? We're going to show them our YouTube channel. How That's we right. started. We're going to show them how we started. So today we have a lot. Uh, I, I've been, we have a lot of kids coming that I haven't seen in a week because I've been sick. But now I'm feeling better. And my, bro, my, my grandma was sick for like two weeks. Yeah, so we are just very thankful to be healthy and be able to Drink work. Drink two waters so you won't. And you got to drink lots of water because I know, because, um, cause it's, it's good for you. Water. It's good for you, and water is good. You need to stay hydrated. You need to stay hydrated. So let's talk about Bullet 7v7 football. Well, well, the program's going good so far, but there's so much that we need to do for it to be better. Yeah. Cause this guy's just gonna go in the middle. Yeah. They can't do it right. I don't know why. Yeah. So we have to, like she said, we have to win tournaments, right? Yeah, I said that. I said that to Uncle T. Yes. Yeah, so. I said I said it to everybody. I said we have to win the tournament. So my dad will give you a what? Good job. A good job. There we go. So we have a tournament coming up in Durant for our 15U. And I think this is a, another tournament that we should win. Yeah, uh, because um, cause that um, you got to get healthy and eat all your vegetables because that makes you strong and bigger. Yes, and if we eat our vegetables and, and we're healthy. Oh, man, let's talk about old man Wolf. He's mean. Yeah, two no. dogs when it was no that's for, that's for episode two old man willis right now it's about bullet football yeah We're, but he ate a he ate a he ate two dogs when it was halloween he did yeah oh you sure uh-huh my wow. dad told me well i'll protect you okay he ate two dogs did he try to eat you no oh. i didn't see him good well He's very delightful i can't see him yeah so uh, I mean, the, honestly, the biggest tournament coming up is the end zone tournament in Houston. Yep, he's he's good at his soccer game. You My know, brother, he's really good at his soccer game, but sometimes he gets zero points. <laughs> Your brother does. Yeah. What about the big tournament coming up in Houston? Do you think we can win that? Mm-hmm. What do we have to do to win that I don't tournament? I live in Houston. But, but we have a big football tournament coming up in Houston. I live. I, I wish I live in Houston. Why? Because. Because of what? I want to change my house into Houston. Mm, what about the gym? Mm, no. I want to change it too. How school go today? I didn't go to school. You didn't go to school. Uh. Everybody's gonna see why. Oh, she wasn't feeling good today, that's why, right? Yeah, because yeah. I had to go. This is my different school. I don't go to that other school. I go to my different school. Oh, okay. I go to two of, I go to two of them. Oh, well, okay. to my school and my other school. So I'm going to talk about football, okay? You going to give me a second? Yeah. Okay. No, you have to. I want you over here. I'm going to see you while you talk like... But I need you right here for the show. Come on, because you're going to be on it. I'm going to look at you while you do Okay, so 
We have a end zone tournament coming up in Houston, which I think is the biggest tournament for all of our athletes. All the media outlets will be there and uh, really just trying to get them to understand and take advantage of every opportunity they get because you don't get too many to make a name for yourself. Unfortunately for now, you know, most of our guys do not have scholarships and not being biased, I think a lot of our guys should have scholarships somewhere, but right now we just don't. And I think this is getting the momentum started for summer camps that leads on to the fall to help get our guys on the radar and prove to everyone that they can play at the highest level, which is Division One or even D1, AA, D2, just college ball after high school. That will all be a blessing for all the guys that I train. So Can you do a low voice? I am. Come over here, baby. Come right here. Can you do a yeah. low voice? But you have to talk so they can hear. You'll see afterwards. But, you know, really just, you know, chopping away every single day. We have three weeks left until the tournament, so. Yeah, you got. We I have got to get better every single day. Say it. Two more days until it's Christmas. Christmas? Christmas ain't <laughs> Man, we got a long time until Christmas. You already thinking about Christmas? Uh-huh. Well, when my, when my brother was three years old and my brother was was in the shower and he, and he was and he was washing his hair and he was and mommy my she was thinking about his dinosaur. My mom said, "What are you thinking about?" And then my my brother said, "I'm thinking about my dinosaur playing soccer." <laughs> How do you know that? You wasn't even born yet. Because. Because I saw the video. Oh, okay. You saw the video. So this is a video for YouTube. You're going to see. Uh -huh. We're going to put it up today. Yep. So we just want to continue to keep getting better, honestly, man. And do what it takes to win the games the right way and come together as a team. Me, personally, I'm learning first year coaching high school. Uh, it's a lot different when I played. You know, I don't like to boast or brag on myself, but it's just a big difference from 10 years ago till now. <laughs> <laughs> so the main thing is, is for me to continue to relate with the players, um, show that I really do care for them yeah. and want what's best for them. Yeah. But they're going to have to put in the work and yeah, take all, in what I'm saying. All the kids. Really listen to what I'm saying because. Because all the, all the kids in, the, in high school and third school, they don't know how to play football. So they need to listen and to Uncle T. third grade. So they need to listen to Uncle T. They need to listen to Uncle T because they don't know how to play football. They, they keep saying hey. That's right. So. We're gonna get back to work Stop on that. Stop going on the edges of the line. Sports club is about to come in in about 10 minutes. And yeah, uh, because camera, I think I don't know nothing because all Blake was being mean to that girl. Okay, we'll talk about that later, okay? Yeah, because. Okay. All right, so back to work. Um, today, we got, today's a Monday, so we're gonna really work our legs. Speed, power, and explosive day. Some sled pushes, uh, okay. some starts, and uh, working on our power and continuing to get better. So, back to the grind it is, and I'll see you guys for the next episode. Come over here, Vivi, so we can tell them goodbye. Okay, but wait, camera. Say one last thing before we turn it off. One last thing before we turn you off. We're gonna say bye and thank you for a YouTube channel. Tell them to subscribe. To subscribe. Bye. <laughs>